Excuse me, sir? My name is Napoleon Bonaparte. Oh, uh, excuse me. Mr. Bonaparte. Shh, I only think I'm Napoleon Bonaparte. Do not listen to the weakling. He denies his lineage because he feels it. I like your jacket. Very strappy. You want it? Uh, you can have it. Uh, just help me undo these buckles in the back and I'll... Uh, what are you doing? The uniform of this army is sacred. We shall wear it proudly until the battle is over. Help me. <laughs> Sacre bleu! I have been hit! Who's winning? Nobody's winning! Want to know who's losing? The Bonaparte family name! Look, I forfeit, okay? You win. Napoleon Bonaparte wins again. Is that the real Napoleon Bonaparte? I mean, the imaginary real Napoleon Bonaparte? Yeah, I'm actually related to him. Can you believe it? Shut up! Stop telling people that shameful fact. I don't even want to be here. But when this sad excuse for a Bonaparte lost a simple game of war to a feeble-minded invalid, I just could not take it anymore. I was forced to take control, and I will stay in control until I beat the love of victory into this degenerate swan who dares to call himself a Bonaparte. No, really, great-great-great-grandpa Napoleon, I do love victory, like, a ton. I love it so much, you can go now, I swear. Your move! What's this? My lazy opponent is actually trying to win? He has sent in reinforcements. Well, well. Then let the game truly begin. Send in my best soldier. You! Destroy that bridge! For France! For France? I hate your stupid bridge. This is how much I hate you! Ha <laughs> ha! Suck on that bridge! Ah, yes. Now I shall go torment this poor peasant over here. <laughs> oh man, now look. The bridge is broken and I can't move my pieces past it anymore. I quit. Napoleon, you win. No, we don't forfeit. We're gonna beat you, Mr. Genetic Memory of Napoleon Bonaparte. Haha, <laughs> I like your je ne sais quoi, your joie de vivre. Maybe you will teach my long-legged nincompoop a lesson, eh? <laughs> Alors... Ow! I wish my own descendants had your fighting instinct. Word to the wise, give up while you can. Fred's gonna win. <laughs> I can burn wood with my mind. Well, that would be how you say, uh... Cheating! Ah! 
Hey, don't touch my pieces! That is cheating!
the steamer trunk tag for this guy. Bugging you? Yes. Well, why don't you come out here and fight him? Mm. What's the pay? Uh, freedom? <laughs> Forget it. Call a doctor? No, I'm not sick. I just can't find any decent food around here. An army moves on its stomach, you know. An elite force such as I require an elite cuisine, I'm afraid. Oh, well, I'll keep on the lookout for some place with good takeout. Only the best, young lad. I am a Frenchman, and anything but the finest French delicacy might bruise my palate and leave me unable to storm anything, save the vomitorium.
It's time to serve the cause. So be it. If it is truly a time of war, then we are ready. We can no longer pull our heads into our shells and hide. We are, after all, armored warriors, and this is our land too. We may not be fast, but we always march upon the glittering path of righteousness, for we created ourselves from our hearts. Lead us onward, and let us eat holes in the leaves of Napoleon's garden. Wow. Right on. Yes. Don't touch my pieces! That is cheating! Hey, don't touch my pieces! That is cheating! You guys ready? Yes! We're ready to fight for the fatherland! Okay. in there. Any carpenters home? Go away, burglar. I'm not a burglar. I'm a recruiter for Fred Bonaparte's army. We're a little light in our corps of engineers, see? Listen, I know you're a burglar. I've been listening to your footsteps on my roof all night trying to break in. Why don't you just slide down the chimney? I got a nice fire going for you in here, Mr. Burglar. Okay. If I'm a burglar, then how can I be down here talking to you and up on the roof at the same time? Maybe you're a ventriloquist. Listen, if I go see what's up on your roof and take care of it, will you come out and help fight Napoleon? <laughs> Maybe. Good enough. Okay, you can come out. Burglar's gone. Wow. You're pretty tough for a ventriloquist. Okay, here I come. Just show me where there's some wood to work on, and I'll go to town.
How about you fix that broken bridge over there? How about you fly me over there? My legs seem to be glued onto this base, which is kind of weird. 